Hey, Tony here. Today I want to show you what I picked up from the Kino Lorber Shocktober sale, so stay tuned. So today I've received my order from Kino Lorber. This is for the Shocktober sale. Um, I did pick up 31 titles, maybe a little bit more, um, last month, and the order finally arrived. So I've got a, I went ahead and I pulled them out of the box, and it's going to take time to show you what I got. So first up, I've got um, Against All Flags with Errol Flynn, Maureen O'Hara, and Anthony Quinn. Um, I've heard a lot of good things about this movie, and I wanted to add it to the collection. I've got Alibaba and the 40 Thieves, another older title. I've got Alice in Wonderland, The Ant and the Aardvark, Arabian Nights, Be Indifferent, Color of Night. Now I currently own a two-pack from Mill Creek for this title and um, I wanted just the single release. It's got two different cuts in it. I did see this one in the theater. Um, and I liked it, so I wanted to go ahead and have just this nice Kino release for it. I got Convoy. I got Agatha Christie's Death on the Nile. And then I picked up um, the um, this animated um, series set. It's got Crazy Les Crane, Sheriff Hoot Clute. The Dogfather, Mr. Jaw, and the Blue Racer. So this is a six. This is a six-disc set. And I got Desperately Seeking Susan. Of course, it has Rosanna, Rosanna Arquette, and Madonna in it. Um, I think I saw this movie once. It was, it was pretty bad, but I wanted to have it in my collection. I got Gator with Burt Reynolds. A Girl Walks Home Alone at Night. I've heard a lot of great things about this one and wanted to add this one to the collection. The Good Son. I really enjoy this um, Macaulay Culkin film. So very happy to have this one. Very different from his portrayal in Home Alone. And then I got Grandview USA with uh, Jamie Lee Curtis, C. Thomas Howell, and Patrick Swayze. I do not believe I've ever seen this one before. Um, Hard Country with Jane Michael Vincent and Kim Basinger in it. It's also got Daryl Hannah and Ta um, Tanya, Tur Tanya Tucker. I've never seen this one before, but it looked like something I would really like. Um, Heartbreak Hotel. Then The Inspector. Lorenzo's Oil. This is a pretty recent release with Nick Nolte and Susan Sarandon. Um, the, the, the Maze is a 3D film. I've heard a lot of good things about this one too. Um, some of the older 3D titles um, are pretty good and this is a nice addition to the collection. Um, Murder by Decree. I got Playing God with David Duchovny in it. Roland and Ratfink. The Scarlet Letter. So this one right here was a pretty bad movie from what, from what I understand. I've never actually seen it. But I did read some places where people enjoyed it. So I got it added to the collection. Um, September Storm, another 3D release. Son of Alibaba with Tony Curtis. And then lastly, I got Tijuana Toads. So as far as, as these animated films are concerned, I believe I got the whole collection now from um, Kino Lorber. I uh, hear a lot of great things about those. 
Um, I did watch those as a kid um, in the 70s. I do not really remember liking them that much, but as an adult, maybe I'll enjoy them better. Um, but anyway, that's all the titles that I picked up. Now, the reason why I picked a lot of these up is definitely because they were on sale. Um, a lot of these were around $7.99 price point, I believe, except for the box set, of course. But it was cheaper for me to buy the box set than it would be for me to buy them individually. Um, I actually do have the prices listed for what I paid for all this stuff. And most items were $7.99 or below. And I paid $320, $320 for all of these titles, which is pretty good. Um, so anyways, there's probably a lot of titles here that most people wouldn't care for. Um, but I thought I'd give them a shot. I do like the older films and um, the obscure titles that are uh, presented here. So I'm definitely looking forward to checking these out. Please let me know if you participated in the Kino Lorber um, Shocktober sale and maybe let me know what you picked up and maybe some of your suggestions of what you would recommend me checking out out of these titles that I picked up. I really do enjoy reading your comments. If you like what you saw here today, please give it a thumbs up and share the video. If you haven't subscribed to my channel, I'd really appreciate it if you'd subscribe. If you do subscribe, please remember to hit that notification bell so that you can be notified every time I upload a new video. If you haven't found me on my social media accounts, I'm on Facebook, Twitter, and on Instagram. And if you'd like to check out what I've been watching, you can find me over on Letterboxd. But thanks again for watching, and we will see you next time.